massive flurry for Jason Christie. And really, it started about 10 minutes into his fishing day. But his fishing day takes about two and a half hours to get going, Tommy Sanders. <laughs> Jason Christie is all about conserving his gas, getting to this little creek. We're not going to get into what the name of this ditch is until we get to possibly Championship Sunday, if you know what I mean. Yeah, but I do. Half ounce covert booyah spinner bait, and we're going to kind of dive in a little more on that spinner bait tomorrow for sure. Christy said he made six casts yesterday morning, caught about 12 pounds, taking a little bit longer today to make those upgrades. But the one thing you can say is this is Jason Christie's strength. Grew up fishing this way, and honestly, watching him do this, absolutely yes. in his wheelhouse. I'm going to say. It's a number five Colorado blade, I believe. But we'll kind of, like I said, we're going to dive into that a little bit more tomorrow. We'll get a picture of that spinnerbait. All lay downs. And as the day's gone along, Jason Christie has made upgrades. Only one other angler in that area with him. I noticed that other angler is starting to creep further into that oh, ditch right okay. now. We'll possibly get into that a little bit more tomorrow. But a very solid day, too, for Jason Christie. And you notice few more spotted bass in his stringer, but as the day's gone on, critical calls with bigger largemouth. Safe to say, Mark Zona, that nobody in this tournament is catching, numbers-wise, anything even close to what Jason Christie's doing, right? No, but I also, I also want you to look at how these fish are built. If you look at this bass right here, I mean, they're about 15 inches long, but they're almost three pounds.